Richard Brown Films, take one. situation right now and I understand how you feel I can see the sadness on your face I know you miss your late wife that passed but you know I'm here for you I can comfort you you will get through this you must get through this so you can get to move on where there is life there is hope your late wife have passed, but you're still here. You understand? So you don't have to worry. Remember, you have me here to help you right through. You understand? So in case of anything, you can just call me. You know, I'll be here for you. Any help you need, just call me. I can help you. And why are you drinking so much alcohol? No, this... this this, this doesn't make any sense. Nikita, I really do appreciate you being here for me at this point in time. It means a lot to me. Yes, me, did you say to your friend? What do you say? Why I'm sorry? So, I never get to come on your boss wife in her But apart from that, I have something serious I want to talk to you. But in regards to me going away on the farm working program. Yeah man, so I want to talk to you about it. Um from when me I say boy I think about say when me go up on the farm work I yeah, priest said, boy, I'm going to run off and straighten up myself. And then, after I straighten up myself, meaning that I'm married, it will probably take one, three years, then I come back and just marry to you and, and take care of her. Realize what you say? What you mean? What you talking about? You get one opportunity to go on a farm work for better with life. I talk about run off. So, you forgot to say, me in our relationship, or we not talk about this? Well, uh, well, I talk, we talk about it, I know, I mean, as Mr. I know, T. I know, I assume, man. We should have talked about this before, I mean, decide whatever, think about it. What yeah, you I say, what I say, As I say, me just when I think about it, I know, I so talk to you about it. So, boy, I think that I the best thing, because if I go up on the farm work, I no must get called back. But at least if I run off, married and straighten up, then that, that I want better life, we can preach a boy, we can buy a piece of land and build one like a horse. You hear what you say, Adam? Hmm? You hear the kind of plan there? You feel say you go get you? You have plan for run off? You have plan for married? Married to who? Me not over there, me over here. Where you go get you married? A, bus a business marriage, me talk about. Me not talk about no just married to just just somebody for relationship. Business marriage, me talk about. No relationship business. Look how much somebody me know run off and go over there and straighten up. And... Oh, mm -mm. Mm -mm. nobody with it. Babes, please me, I beg you, nobody with it. Puss and dog not the same look. Some go up and then kind of marriage there and pay for people marry them. And you know, immigration, everything they end up in a that's bad. Even the same people we come from the same country where they come from can use to find them when they man them in our little pasta pasta because they know so they're not straight. They call them immigrant pa. What you say? Mm -mm. And my money I go spend so therefore I know say this half work. What do you mean? 
you, you, you assume your destiny, you get a judge or what. You know how much people end up go pay for people married to them just because of papers they want to stay in a country. Eh? And they end up they together forever in a long term relationship and end up breed all the woman. So I'm not going to see you back again. Babes, no. listen to me, I tell you, nothing like that now go happen, man. Hear me, I tell you, man. I don't want to make me a bully or nothing. But when I say, final, I don't want to do So just, just work with me, no, man. Work with me. Alright. You give a benefit, I doubt. Here? Yeah? yeah, man, that sounds yeah. more like it, man. All we have to do, I just. Make one little baby before me go for it. Hi, father. No, I'm there, alright? Yeah, man. Um, I don't know if you want to tell us uh, the last of the paperwork he's filing about to come to. Um, yeah, she did say something about, she did say something about that, I think I win. Think I just third year so? Okay, alright, you come to come too, man. So as soon as you come to, uh -huh. we just sort of start out everything and make up home, alright? Yeah, but daddy, otherwise, Brandon, may I ask you a question? Yeah, man. You couldn't make mommy come up there too? Like, I don't want to come by myself. Well, my daughter, I couldn't do that, I do that. But you know, I'm not a mother for a long time, and I'm not married, and I don't have my family over here already. So I can't file for her. But when you come up, when we fall to your book, you can just start out to keep her up after three years and just take her up. Alright? Alright then. Yeah, I get what you say. Alright. Who are you mother then? She there in her room. Alright. So tell us about that to her. Mommy. Hi. Um, Daddy want to talk to you. May I come? Hmm? Yeah. I'm going to talk to him, I just go in here, so. <clears throat> Melea. You look good, you know. So, you know, so I always look nice. Sometimes I don't have time to really do certain things with me here and so, but everything good. What, what are you dealing with? Yeah, when just I tell me this, that's the last paperwork to come through, you know, which is the DNA part. So, as soon as um, I get it, I just call him and just send you to deal with the DNA. I can't wait for that to come true. I don't know why we why, why have to go through all of this. Why you have to do DNA? She couldn't just come over there, so. Well, uh, well I don't know. I said, DNA have to do, you know. I'm American government, so that's that just part of that, that procedure. That don't mean that me, me and her father is just for them to prove that me and her father. All right, so, but. but... I go want some money and, and she she gonna need some more clothes and so. She don't have to get no new clothes. When she come over, we try to go buy some new clothes. Any money too, you figure that? Oh yeah. Don't worry about the money, man. We have to send some money come down. So you can buy some things for your own thing, alright? Alright, me one time, ah. Look more. Just hurry up and start all the thing. You see them paper here? Mm -hmm. Are the last set of paper them? So everything I get now? Yeah man, but me I wait for them. So they're not all bird paper? Mm hmm the bird surface ticket and everything. Mm -hmm. Give me, me just want to show it. I don't want to hold in your hand too long to just crush them up. Yes, so all of the documents them? Yeah. Mm hmm you know this. So, the only thing leave is the DNA. That alone left for we do now. DNA for what, mommy? I know my father. What do you mean? What do you mean? Of course, I'm your father. So, where are we going to do a DNA? Alright, listen. Once your father overseas and he want to file for you out here, if you get to come over, they can't live with him, mm -hmm. you have to do the DNA. So then can prove, say, him and your daddy. 
You understand? Even if I'm me as your mother did overseas, I'm going to want to take you over and you're over here with your father. Same procedure. We have to follow it. You have to abide by them rule. I them policy that we have to go by it. You understand? I understand what you say. Anyway, Brittany, mm -hmm. Mrs. Say, I want to say something. What, was it, what were you going to say before? Mm -hmm. What I say is, just know so when I go overseas, I never go forget you. I never forget you. And when I go over there, I suck down and I start making some money the right way and everything good for me, I go file for you. And I look up and the work we have out here, the housekeeping, Mrs. Senna really help out, you understand? So would I like if you come over and then stuff the and that's... if you could have even get a housekeeping work over there, that would have even better because they pay better over there mm. and you could have saved your money and then stuff there. Mm -hmm. So the more better off for you on your side and on my side the same way. Anyway, it's like how we are look about your papers and everything for you overseas. Mm -hmm. Make sense you stop going to school. Why? You know, make no sense. That are just waste of money. Remember, say when you get through and go overseas, you have to go to a different school and you have to go start all over again. Mm -hmm. So, me continue. They continue to go to school right now. Out here, so. I waste of money, waste of time. So, you yeah. just stay home and just wait till you pay for them start out and then you're good to go. You're gone. You understand? Your life will go better, man. Don't worry yourself. Alright, mommy. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I'm going to put up this because these are very important. Alright. So, I'm going to hear a little bit. Alright, mommy. Hello. Hello. Hi, what's going on? Well, I'm not calling for quarrel, no, but you know, so I get back the, um, the DNA results for Brittany. Mm hmm. Yeah, and, and how come you have to give me Jackie to pick me? Eh? Wait, Wait me. Me. Me, have me, they have friends, and me have send money to come give you every week. Not one week for us, and I have to send money to come give you. Wait, me. I'm not ready to file to pick me and take him my friend. At that, at that, I, 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 I resolved them again. Uh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. You call me if you trick me or what? What do you mean? Where do you talk about Jackie Pitney and DNA and you know, right and whatever? I mean, I understand. Listen, man. Listen, man. And I make up no story, you know. And this is what come back from the, from the, from the, from the, um, from the embassy. After me done, send me up bag of money to the paperwork, get lawyer one bag of things. I know, no, the DNA do. I don't feel me pick me. Tell me now, where are you going to tell me? I don't understand this. I swear, I don't understand this. So if I know... Obviously, you did have one next month. No, if I know you are your father, I could have owed them. Brother, I'm going to tell you the same question. You are asking me if you asked me that. Brother, I'm going to tell you the same question. Brother, I'm going to tell you the same question. Brother, I'm going to tell you the same question. Brother, I'm going to tell you the same question. No, I don't understand this because I don't have nobody with you. I'll make calls, I'll make calls if you tell you that, and you have to go explain to, to Brittany and tell him exactly what is what, because this thing which she coming to foreign is a no-no again right now, so that, that's all the table, and the little mom that we used to send a month and see her, that get cut off right now, that get cut off, so when I go work that out, they just explain to her, so she not have to call me, so me not have to tell her. So, so, so you can't do one next day in DNA. Me not believe in a first DNA. You can't do one next one. Listen, man. Listen, listen. Me not, me not go through this video. And it's just of God. Me not go through with it. Not, not even one half percent chance to come back. Ninety, 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 ninety-nine percent. And I'm my father. Jesus. So, work that out. But if anything, look up for me. I'm already called up it. I'm going to call up the choir. I'm going to call up the choir. I'm going to call up the choir. I'm going to make a noise. So everything done here. So. All right. All right. Yes, sir.
day, man. Oh, I'm Casey, so you look so smarty dead. You know, like when you look so in a car, right now, you come down here, you come down here, come look for me, dear. Happy, 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 look for you now. Eh? What do you? Come talk to me, what do you? You know, say I'm the only sister and I alone me can talk to until certain things. Right now, I stress out. I stress out till it come like. All the year, they come like the man drop out on me. Oh, I stress. You remember Pretty the other day? Right? No, no. Yes, maybe. Me no what do you mean, maybe? What do Brittany? Nothing to no, do her. So, what do you? Why you look so? Because if you there, so I'm not no do Brittany. Who dead? Me there, me not dead. We move my dead and go a long time. And so, so, go again. Leah, I'm not dead alone, stress out people, you know. I'm dead alone, Mrs. Stress out all you, so, so, what do you? Let me tell you what I really are going. You remember the other day when we did a talk to you about Brittany? Mm-hmm. See, her father, the file. Yeah, I remember that. How she mm -hmm. should go here and sit me. But, then did have to do DNA. And one if I sit so some whole heap of paperwork and all kind of things when they go down. Mm -hmm. I can't believe. Our father called me on the phone, good, good meeting, so everything all right now, so Brittany, I go go and everything. Mm -hmm. And tell me, say, 99, nine, one one heap nine. Lord Jesus, say, the DNA come out. And a fiend pick me. The DNA result come out, say, in a match. You know what? I know fiend pick me, Jesus Christ. I could never believe me. So when he talk to me on the phone, my uncle left for fiend. I turn idiot. I hardly say something to him on the phone. Because he come like me astonish. I one and two words I say to him. I just love him make him matter. Because I don't know what he say. After so many years, no, me happy, my sister. Say, your niece, my child, I go go overseas. Me I'll stop Britney from going to school, you know. No, Britney, I figure go back to school. But they even know what to tell us if you do right now, because I don't know about them sitting here. I me, me, me never experienced, I don't have no experience with, with them sitting here. I never yet have experience with them sitting here in my life. Eh? A movie, I see them sitting here only on TV. How you manage with them sitting here, Rachel? Hey! So, so how you going to tell Brittany this? You tell Brittany? By the way, you tell Brittany? No, no, no. Me so, how no, you going to tell Brittany? I don't know how to tell her, you know. But I don't know how to face her yet. I'm not ready to tell her. Because she has to start back school out here and if it need, don't give up on school already can me stop her from go to school till her say when she go overseas, she has to go start all over again so it makes sense. Yeah, the next one to you will well, positive say go overseas, you tap it from go to school. Okay? So what you gonna do now? Now that him be so all of them the sitting there, what she what you, what you gonna do now? How long now she tap go to school? A good while. We are call good night. One month now? Good while, man. Good while. Right here now, the way my head chip me say from my ear say the DNA come out and the result come out say. He is not the daddy. Me no know when he did stop go to school or when he did start. Me no remember. I need Jesus. Cause me can't help you. Me no know no about them. Look here. Me no go be the one to tell Brittany none of this, you know. I feel pick me and I you are so go be the one to turn up and be honest with her. And when he come to me, me no know nothing how I go on. Me no know nothing nothing how he go. Me no know nothing nothing go. You can't send her, tell her, look here. Right now, me, as you left over here, I'm going to see if we can go and go lock up in the house or find someone to come in. Father God, I beg you to do. Look here, only thing I beg you to do is be honest with my child. Be honest with Brittany. She deserves to know the truth.
day. Oh no. Oh, what, oh, what is here? Oh, we have pick up a do now. Mommy, what happened to you? Yeah, drink, yeah, drunk. Mommy, you really need to talk to me and tell me what's wrong with you. They can't stay like this. Not even one beer in here, put, you know, put out your mouth. Not even one beer buckle. Are you there a drink, mommy? Really? Mommy, come and if you talk to me, please. Brittany, it's right now. I'm in a no talking mood. What do you mean in a no talking mood, mommy? Mommy, you need to talk to me. I'm not you stay like this. I know you stay like this, mommy. Just please talk to me. I need to know what I'm going on in your life. What are you worried about? Brittany, you're my daughter. I'm in love. You know, I'm in love. You don't. Yes, mommy. Basically, right now, I need no frame of mind, no tall, to talk to you at this moment. But as soon as me. Mine come back to come I really want if you come back to let me talk to you. Don't worry yourself. You know me always love you. Mommy. I understand what you say, but I don't like see a drink. That's all. When I'm in free, I feel like I want to talk to me about certain things, you talk to me. But the drinking part just please don't follow it up because you're not nice. I mean I want nothing to happen to you because you're my mother. And I alone me have now. As soon as my head come back to home, I really want if you come back to me, I'm going to talk to you. Don't worry yourself, you know I love you, right? All right, man. Yes, Miss Vikita? You don't have to cook any food this evening for me, because I would be working late. So? I'm not expected to come in back anytime soon. Okay? Okay. And um, we did discuss a raise. I no, I have not forgotten you. I am going to definitely be increasing your wage for this weekend, all right? So have a good day. Okay. Um, excuse me, sir. What's up? The cleaning stuff finished, and I'd like to get some money to get some more. Mm. I don't have any cash on me now. But hear what? Take my card. Uh, which card to give you? Right, use this one. I forgot and the PIN number, sir. It is um, 119. It? Okay. Yes. All right. All so right. anything else? No, no. That's okay. All right, Nikita.
Miss Anita. Miss Nikita. Miss Nikita. Miss Nikita, what is going on here? What are you doing in my bed? You, you take out my most expensive alcohol and drink it off? What kind of behavior is this? What, what has gotten into you lately? Um, sir, um, just take a look of it. And you damn near finished my whole bottle. I just, let me just taste a little bit. This is not... But, but, Sarah, what are you having there, sir? Because my head hurt me. You, you, do you understand that your behavior is atrocious right about now, you know? You know I should fire you? Fire? What do you mean? I don't do anything to get fired, sir. I cannot believe this. I come home only to find you in my bed, drinking my alcohol. No, oh, lady. Look here, you know. You see, the only reason, I'll let you know this, the only reason why I'm not firing you right now, you know, is simply because, you see, when I was at my lowest point and my wife died, you was there for me, you know. And the only reason that right now I'm giving you a chance, you know. But, please, come, come, get, get up, man, get up, get up, get up. Don't get upset, sorry. Get up, please, may, please. May, could I drink the rest? You, you look like you're, you're really still... Come, please, 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 please. You, you are fully, fully drunk. Careful. Wash your face. This is unprofessional. You've been with me for so long. <coughs> <laughs> Unlike you, you know, you have been a professional and been with me for so long, and you have never displayed this behavior. No, you're here drunk in my bed. What is going on, sir? We just find out one sad, sad story. And. I did that thing about it the whole time during when I work today. And I just couldn't take it no more when I clean. I see alcohol. And I believe that when I drink it, I get over it. But I don't think it's so easy if you come out of my head. Because I still have think about it right now. My baby father, were they fine? Yes. In the one DNA with my daughter, where we have, when we believe, say, we have together. And in find out, say, the child is not his own. Your daughter, Mikita, the one that I watched grow up, that you speak so highly of, and the father, which is in, which is overseas, that has been supporting your child for all these years, are you saying that he is not the father? I know me, say, so I DNA. So all the money them we may use to get, we not go get them no more. Why? That is a very rough place to be in, you know. And I look in the go look out our papers we take her overseas. But because wow. the DNA say he's not the daddy, him can't look out our paper again. So me and her go stuck at Jamaica. I am that that is really some bad news, you know. Still not grounds for you to be in my bed. However, please forgive me, sir. I just shown me in us this kind of problem. I can understand why you're, you're actually drinking. Um, it's, it's not every day you hear stories like this. In. But you have to find other ways to deal with it. You cannot take up drinking for it, let alone on the job. It's because of the love and respect I have for you why I'm still keeping you. I would like this one not to happen, not to repeat itself. You have to find other ways to sort out yourself, Miss Nikita. The, room, the alcohol will not be it. Okay, sir. Please.
Altin. Kau sebut ni. Muak. Mungkin ada akses sokong. Apa mami? Apa? Mana ada dia? Mana nua? Like. A first me as in mommy drink. I come home and see her drunk. And I really, I really want to know what I want to hear. So that's the reason why I come to you. I really want, I don't know if you know anything what I want, where you could have tell me, please. Because I don't like see mommy in this condition here. <laughs> Brittany? Yes? I don't to tell us that I don't know what's wrong with your mother. No. But hear what happened now. It is not my place to tell you. The reason why. But but the fuck say she had drink that part is strange. Cause me no know her as no drinker. So me, me actually glad say you come to me come say this. Cause if you never tell me, me wouldn't know. It about me from what the me just really need somebody so to talk. That's so. the only thing that she's doing? She looks stressed out. So what you plan to do? I don't know. I never did want to go to her. So I said, I just want to come to you instead of maybe you would have Brittany, known something. What I know is what I know. But what you should know, you have to go to your mother for that. Isn't it? Hi, Auntie. Hear what I say. Go back home and talk to your mother. Wait until. She alright again. She na drink and all of that. If you see she a drink, you just take you away from her and sit her down and talk to her. Cause it is not my place to talk to you about anything that is happening. Mommy, you can come here, please. Me need a minute with you. Me need to talk to you about something. Yeah, come. Mommy, Mommy, me know me did a piece from good while now about the same situation. And you na say nothing to me. However, Auntie me come from this a while ago and she has said something about she has said it in a code, understand? Like she know what happened but me no know what happened, and she don't want to tell me. So she has said, Are you me to come to about everything? Anything when me want to know, are you me to come to come ask? So I said, Alright, then may I come to you and ask what happened? Because I really need to know what happened. So I need to come clean because I'm alone there in the dark. Everybody in the light, everybody know what happened. I'm alone. Mommy, I'm time for you to highlight me about what I'm going Alright. I'm willing to tell you. I want to tell you for a long time, but I never know how to come to you with it. Mm. I know you're going to feel away. Because I know nothing good me to tell you. But just hear me out. Alright. You know, I'm going to go far and again. Yes, mommy? I have to go start back school. Start back school? Yes. I'm not about to go far in. Just hear me out. Your father is not your father. I don't know if you understand when I say it that way, but when I go down more in the details, maybe you will understand me because you're big enough if you understand anything when I say to you. I mean, we have sense. Mommy. Listen, listen, just listen. Hear me out. Please. No, Mommy, look here. No, just listen. Yes, he must prove. Say you is not his child. So the DNA test said that. The DNA come back. They have to do it back over because I have to do this. No, you serious? And him saying now, saying no more money can give me again for you. So, mommy, wait there. What do you mean if you tell me say is the only man I ever call my father is not my father? Me not even a goddess so. I ask you a question. Mommy, who is my father? Since him and I'm my father, I need to know my father. I'm not. Look. Jesus Christ. 
Next thing, mommy, I'm going to make me tell everybody at school. So, I'm going to go overseas, I'm going to go foreign. And then next, I'm going to go back to school now. I miss up on Mommy, even test. I didn't even have exam, mommy. I didn't know to do it. I understand. I know. It's my fault. But when I go to school, everybody is going to laugh at me. You know? No, listen to me. You... See, I'm a liar. I'm going to go overseas just because I don't want to come to school for the exam. Mommy, I didn't even you can't, can't change you from that school. You can't change you from that school. You don't have to go back to school. You don't have to go back to school. Listen, you don't have to school in Jamaica. Mommy, come on. Let me ask you a question before we start about the school. Is Who is my father? Who am my father? Oh, listen. I never cheat on your father. <gasps> but there's a possibility that don't even somebody say. will me. Don't even say my father. You never did achieve for my father. No, no, just, just he are the yes. yeah, If you don't know who my father, mommy, eventually you did a you did a cheat. No, no, no. Just and it come like say more than one man I did a cheat with mommy. No, I just one person. You know this shameful for no say me don't know who my father. Why I talk so loud? You're gonna make everybody hear now saying I don't know your father. Just listen to me. And I mean it all look bad for you. I know, I know, but me don't shame already. I feel time to take shame, but just listen. Oh, take shame. Just mommy, me lower at my mouth yeah, that listen to no, mommy. Just listen to me, please. Just listen to me. There is somebody. I just one time, one time. I don't know what time. <laughs> I don't know cheat. Me really did a cheat. Me and him never did. We never did. But a cheat. No, listen, listen. As long as he did I see that the person, I could even one no, time. No, I I could even half a time. I still cheat a cheat. So me sure say if it's not the man when me tell you say your father, it's this man. So me I go go to him and talk to him. And settle this, make you know your right so father. Mommy, your what me I go do? Father. Pick and choose and refuse. No. Who am I father? No. That's you, mommy. No, 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 no. You just take me and fling go, go get every man. See, you my father. No, no, shh, take time, please. Mommy. Mommy. No, just hear me out, please. Me I go go to the person when me know, say, me did do it with one time. Different from the man who me did it for so much years, where me call it, say, your daddy. And now we happen to be and your father. Me sorry about everything. Mommy, I'm very, very sorry. It makes sense. But, you never come to me and tell me, say, me I go overseas. If you never sure, if I didn't know, say, me have to do a DNA test. No, listen. I you never sure who if I'm a father. It makes sense. Jesus you did do it behind on my back. It yes, makes I... sense. You did do it behind on my back, mommy. And then after, you come surprise me and say, no, if I, when I find out, say, my father free, like, if not I'm a father, you surprise me and tell me, say, me I go overseas. If not I'm a father, it just make everything just stay normal. Brittany. Mommy, you know what? Me don't even want to hear nothing more. Me don't want to hear nothing more. Auntie. What, Brittany? Imagine. Everybody did hide this from me. You, my mother, everybody. Only oh, never met me know say, Oliver. And never my father. How oh, never make me know that? You're evil, love. Look here, right? Let me get for here, mommy. Stop it, that's a Brittany. So, stop it, that's a right, that's a Brittany. What do you mean by stop Don't it, that's so? Listen to me. Do not say that about your mother. Regardless of everything that happened right now, your mother loves you. And no, me mommy. want you to know that. Right now, they must see you happen to the best of you as a woman out there. <laughs> Remember me tell you that you must love your mother because your mother loves you. Love me and I hide that from me. I bet me to be and walk out of your house just a while your ago. Your love you. And if your mother never loved her, she probably wouldn't tell her this. She yeah? She'd probably not be in a denial same way until you say, yeah, I'm going to Love your mother and stop. Behave like you don't have no sense. If me never your go back. Your mother love you. Stop talk bad about your mother and disrespect your mother. Your mother love you. Why, can't, why you can't sit through, through what she has said to you? Or what through, through what me has said to you? My mother eh? love me and I hide things from me. If me never go over there just a while ago and don't pan her about it, she will not tell me anything. Brittany. You think a little bit of time your mother won't tell her this? Fran, Fran she found out this a thing. You think I know she won't tell her a long time your mother won't tell her this? Then why she never tell me? Brittany, she probably don't know how to tell you and she don't know how you're going to feel about the situation. Listen <laughs> to me, your mother love you. Love your me. mother love you. I mean, she's going to see to it that she find a way. I mean, to make you find out who your father is. Stop behaving like you don't have no sense. What me want you to do is go back over there to your mother and apologize. Because I know, know you cuss, cuss her out and left her over there. You know? So I want you to go back over there and apologize to your mother. And remember, 
You see all of this where you see your mother do all of the drinking and all of them things that you see she do and I get drunk and all of them things there. It's because she don't know how to say it to you. She's stressed out over the entire situation. And she should have stressed, not you. So more you could go back over there, go apologize. No matter look for me like that. Go over there, go apologize to your mother. Because she never must have to tell you. She could have had a dinner and tell her, say, Oh, you go for next month or you go for next week. She could have never tell you. You could have never know, say, you him and your father. So apologize to your mother. I mean, I want you not move from here. Go apologize to your mother, your old daughter. Auntie. I apologize about everything. Um, I know I'm overreact and I'm really sorry about that, but I still feel a way about the situation. I go over my auntie, that's how I go and she did talk to me. And I come to my senses and say, Best me can't apologize because when I did behave, I never really called for. You say I gotta try. Make me know my father. So I give you a chance to do that. Brittany, me never know. I am so sorry me apologize to you too. Yeah. Me supposed to. You understand? I'm sorry. But you is my daughter and I love you very much. So I know why you have in your head say, me know say that man wasn't your father and give you to that man. Me never know. Seriously, I did not know. And I would never do such a thing like that. Yeah, but I am going to make all necessary means and ways an arrangement. Just to make you know your right father. Just have it in mind that you are not a jacket. Just keep it in your mind, say you are not a jacket. Right, because somewhere or the other, if I know the one overseas, I the one out there. Because the one overseas, me and him did live together before he go overseas. So me things there him. And I did want you to hear me out because me not really did in or nothing with him. You understand? So, so don't worry yourself. So, you know, so I love you, don't. I'm going to find out everything. I'm going to go to him and talk to him, and then I'm going to make you meet your father. You have to meet him. Dr. Lipkis, I need Please. to talk to you, sir. Nikita, why I thought you had left already? I have something very, very important to talk to you about. What is on your mind? Um, you see the other day? Yes. When, when you came home and you saw me drinking. Yes. I have something very, very bad that happened to me and my daughter and my mind. That's the reason why I was drinking like that. But you did, you did explain to me what had happened and, you know, I shared my sympathy. Um, is there something else? Yes. Um, the man that I thought get me pregnant, mm -hmm. hmm, and it became the child became somebody else's child because he told me that the child is not his. Was such a such a bad he situation. went and do a DNA. Right. So when the DNA came out, problems started from there with me. So I was thinking a lot and I have to start drinking. The drinking did not help me still. But after that, I was so, so stressed. My head was paining me. Mm -hmm. I didn't know what to do. And... I have something to ask you. All right, I do you remember the last time when we spoke about drinking before I go home? A few years ago, we were drinking a lot of alcohol and the both of us were drunk. 
we end up stop right there sleep together Nikita sir I said to you before we should never and will never speak of that night I want you to erase it out of your memory as if it never happened why sir it happened and it never happened it is or was a very complete and utter mistake I was at my vulnerable point and you was there for me and I appreciated you for that night no listen sir listen remember when your wife died you were drinking a lot I was the one who was there for you we were drinking together the both of us got drunk I understand we slept together and that I night I don't want you to say that I got, prog I, I got pregnant on that night and the only what person talking about you get pregnant on that the only person I slept with different from the man that me thinks eh, I did my baby for that is only you because I'm not a cheater I don't cheat and that accidentally happened because we were drunk I don't tell no lie Dr. Lip Doctor, Doctor, Dr. Lip Kiss I don't want to spoil up your name sir sorry if I call it in, an, in the wrong pronunciation but listen that happened because we were both drunk if i did sober i would never do such a thing like that and all these years i thought that the child was for him you understand so i am going to take the child to meet you someday soon because the child need to know the right father and you are the father and Mr. Nikita, i can swear on my life you are the only person different from that man that I thought was my baby father I slept with. That so you are the father. Night was an so you accident. Believe, just do a DNA. That night was an accident. It should have never been conceived even in your thoughts or in your mind it to be brought back up. Why are you bringing back up such an incident? You need to go do one DNA too. I mean, uh, if I'm but I mean, a uh, dream. I mean, I uh, ask you if the child is yours. 100%. Go and go do the DNA. You was 100% sure it was for the other man. Yes. No, you, you are now 100% yes, sure because, it was for me. Because me be drunk when me come in a bed with you. Me sleep with you. Me not think say in a me drunk stage, I get pregnant for another man. Because me did have my personal man. Snikita. I am a man of firm beliefs in family and responsibility as a matter of fact my brand is built on that and if it is a case that i am this child's father you are the father i will step to the plate like a man and actually strip in and do whatever it is that i need to do at this point in time let us arrange the date we can go do a paternity to a no DNA. No problem. No problem. I don't have a problem with that. All right. And if the case is that she is my daughter. You're going to take up full responsibility and sustain your child as a daddy. I would definitely be standing up as a man. And I would also would like to meet her. Wait. Does she even know about this possibility? When you say ask her, I don't come to talk about whether she knows or she doesn't know. Me need you to do the DNA and when you find out that you're a child, start supporting your picnic. And guess what? I stop work for you as from today, sir. Because I told me that I work here, you admit that happened, man. You know? So I get another job. So anyway, I just thought I did come to talk to you about Think about it. Everybody, how you doing? I'm doing fine. Good. It's nice, nice. Uh, sort of an awkward situation. However, I'm pretty sure we can um, talk. Britain. Um, you want my phone? 
well not in this forum actually i mean the news is that i'm actually your father and that is wow uh let me start out by saying like i honestly did not know what was happening i did not know we were not aware of the whole situation and um i am not sure how you're receiving this at this point but i hope you just have an open mind to the situation that i would really like to be a part of your life i really would like to be a part of your life i know i can make up for the years and that has passed because you are clearly now a big girl but going forward i would just like to you know be there and try and you know make as much memory as possible just know say oh, if there's anything you need or anything that you want to talk about you can come to it otherwise i'm always open to you and we'll always be open to your scene as now you that you are my actual biological mentor. bedroom tonic so as we always I say if there are persons out there that want to improve them sexual experience link up Dr. Jack to the number up on his shirt you know me I say he has some some male enhancement pills at the end of the day people might feel afraid and say oh me don't need that me don't need that it's not no Viagra you know me I say it's not a Viagra it's a healthy product in terms of natural herbs and, and bushes them in use make the capsule them and they are for enhancement you don't know you can't expect say if you are if you are 50 or 60 or 40 you're gonna be the same as a 19 year old and 20 year old you know what i say so it just help to boost your sexual drive and not only that on a day-to-day -day basis if you're, you're a man who work hard you know say you are gonna need something for you if you just give that extra strength because like, you work hard, you know what I'm saying? I'm not talking about sick, I'm not talking about from a healthy perspective, you want something to make you feel healthy and strong. So the pill also helps to boost that. And it also has a bottle for the ladies that we need to get them body detox. If you can't get pregnant, that can also help you. So link him up, same, same, same Instagram um, handle there. So you can check him out on Instagram. It's Dr. Jack Bedroom Tonic. Check him out on Instagram and here is his telephone number. Link him up and yeah, I can make some arrangement how you get in product. Alright? Richard Brown Films, take one. But why can't we get you got too far? You got so else. <laughs> you got two on different dimensions. So long, you're going to take everybody here. I'm saying, I'm going to say, 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 i if you make me knees find out, they may sit me right now. Because guess what? A problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to change the job. When is she, man? When is she, man? She's a man, fool. No, I can't do that. Never. That's what I want to say. You know, you want to just tell him, say, go and tell Brittany. He said, go and tell him. Oh, you Brittany. did oh. say, you're not going to tell Brittany and me if you tell Brittany. Yeah, yeah. You yeah, have yeah, to go find some way out. Okay. Yeah, just be honest with Brittany. You have to go and tell him. All right, ready. All right, ready. See. No, I just that's fine, and I just want to look up at the kitchen. But me, no, I'm ready, 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 ready now. You ready? Yeah. yeah. 
Yeah, we went just to tell Britney this side of the last paperwork to come through, you know, which is. I can see the sadness on your face. I know you miss your late wife that passed. But you know, I'm here for you. I can comfort you. Jesus Christ, you can't. You just sound like I try to seduce him. I just why you can't. Why you sound like I try to seduce him? I can him. comfort you. Nobody I try to hit the guy in the trees. Pain. I try to sleep with the bag. I'm not sleep with him. You can't. You can't. You can't. Thank you. Thank you, Nikita. Mm -hmm. I really appreciate. Can I walk? Mm -hmm. And then you make it a close up by your hand. You raise your hand, Papi. Sit down, Ken. Give us some back. Ready? Sit down. Just sit down and say nothing. So many times I talk to you. Okay. Okay. Yeah, man. So, we're at the end of the movie. Um, The scene we just shot, it's going to be in the movie. But I just said, let me do a, a closing half as it pertains to talking to you. The supporters, you know, say, what well, go already. Me love to talk to you know, at the end of the movie. Um, for all different type of reason. Sometimes it might just be for the simple reason to say, thank you for supporting for, to all the persons who have um, been supporting the journey thus far. More, say, thank you. It has been a long one. You know, I say, but this year I feel it in my spirit that this year is the year that we are gonna make the real set of moves and that. We've been talking about and we've been planning because things have been aligning, lining itself, and we just have to just take things in strides. Um, my wife is a big up to Nalida. She came all the way from Netherlands to spend a week with us, and we really appreciate that because it goes to show that persons are watching what we're doing and they're loving what we're doing, and they just want to be a part of the family. It makes them feel that sense of something good so they want to be a part so i want to say thank her for coming today is her birthday and more want to say happy birthday to her but it's not a post on her birthday it's a post after so happy birthday to her um and if there are other persons out there who love what we are doing and want to come spend a, a week or so we are two weeks you are welcome we can just make all the necessary arrangements and you come um there are things that we still need we still need some more props. We still need um, clothes that we can wear in the movie. Anything just to enhance the look of what we're trying to do. We still need finance just to help get the thing to the next level. Um, we'd buy two brand new cameras at a day. Um, we still think we would need one more microphone, need some more light stands. You know, there are always things that are always needed for the, for the level of the production to get better and to grow. Um, if there are persons out there who have scripts and you love what we are doing, you want to invest some money as being a producer in, in a film, you can just link me up with Chad Brown, films at gmail.com or on Instagram and we can talk and you produce a film and we just try to get it outside of YouTube. Because that's the thing. Or if you don't have a script and you don't have money that you want to invest, I can write the script and we get the project done and we try to get it on a streaming platform where it can bring back revenue. Um, you can hear it now, my voice a crack. It means I'm tired, but it's non-stop work. So we continue for work. Candida in her background, she one of the hardest worker and also one of the most loyal person who died with me from day one. So I want to say thank you to her too. You know, the journey go on. You know, and we just continue to do what we are do and make great moves. There is the, um, what we call it, the, the grant. The government just launched a grant fund which is going to be um, ending this end of this month, which is April. And we definitely um, want, access, want access to your grant. Hopefully we get it. If we don't, the journey continues just the same. Because, you know, it's a non-stop effort. And I believe in what I do. I have people who believe in me too. You know, and we just continue to do what we do. And give thanks to everybody who play a role in a Richard Brown film's growth and for the persons who continue to act in the movie them, thank the public, Alton, LG, you know, Brittany who who they are now and then same way. Um, you know, all of, all of the persons and we, we knew actress um, who they are with me too, Leah, you know, we just want to see she grow from strength to strength and make the thing better. My son who they are who are the most of the filming now and a lot of the editing, you know, 
appreciate him just the same. You know, to everybody who continuously make what we are doing possible. Vassal, big up yourself. Um, we thank you. You know what I say? And um, Dre. Dre. Yeah, man, Dre, big up yourself too. Yeah, man, Dre Snan, big up yourself. We appreciate everybody who always just ensures that they put out, you know, put out strength in our way. We love you, we respect you, and we just continue to do what we do. And if people out there want to contribute to what we do, I want to contribute to a specific actor or actress, link me up. We can make the connection with, with the actor or actress. And if you want to send a donation for them, we appreciate it. Big up on yourself, continue to support what we do while we continue to go. Yeah.